So why do we use skimming in uh, Pega? So what is the purpose of skimming? Okay. So first of all, understand the definition of skimming. So skimming is basically used for the rule maintainability. So if you have the large count of rules increasing, so as the application size increases, definitely you keep adding certain rules. And as and when you add certain rules, it has to associate to a rule set and a version. So the versions will increase, okay? So over the period of time, the versions keeps going, okay? So as and when the count of the rule increases, so what happens? The similar kind of rule may be copied into the next subsequent versions, okay? So the same rule might be available in multiple versions, okay? So these are there are multiple copies of the same rule is available. Okay, so instead of that, we just maintain a single copy, we just copy them into one single version. Okay, so it doesn't want to maintain multiple copies and it reduces the rule maintenance as well. Okay, so that is the reason we go for skimming. So skimming main purpose is the rule maintainability. So as and when the application size increases, the rule set versions increases and the count of the rule size increases. So in order to maintain certain limited the rules and to have to have multi, instead of having multiple copies, we maintain a single copy. So for that reason, we do have a skimming. So now coming to this, we have two type of skimming operations. One is minor version skimming and major version skimming okay major version skimming so what is the difference between these two is so as and when you are having the rules which are let's say 0 1 0 1 0 1 so there is a you start with one set one set of rule set 0 1 iphone 0 1 iphone 0 1 so which already you might know that this is a patch version the middle one is a minor version and the first one is a major version major minor patch version so now what happens is your minor patch versions you keeps incrementing so you may do it while doing the development you keep incrementing the patch version so major and minor remains same the patch version grows so you the patch version might be incre incrementing with respect to 0101 in that way okay so 01 to 02 0, 02 to 0, 03 so in that way you keep incrementing so till 99 you have that option okay so once you are done with this 99 what happens the next version you will move is 01 iphone 02 iphone 01 okay so this way the versioning that you will keep adding so now what happens is so you are going to have instead of 01 01 99 so all these rules, so here you may have some 100 rules, okay? So similarly, you may have some rules in this, okay? So the rules between 0, 01 to 99, you have 100 patches, okay? So 99 patches over here, okay? So those 99 patches, you can move it to the highest to minor version. So which is your 01, 02, 01. So the minor will increment. So in the minor version skimming, the minor version will increment and all these rules between 0, 01 to 99 patch versions will be moved together to a highest minor version. So that is considered as minor version skimming. Okay, so minor version skimming will bring all together the rules of the patch versions to the next highest minor version. So that is something we call it as a minor version skimming. The same applicable for the major version as well. So you may have 0, 01, 0, 01, 0, 01, to 01 0 99 0 something okay so here you may have some of the versions all you may it is not mandatory to get till 99 also you may go with the 10 or 20 as well okay so you may have 0 01 iphone 20 iphone xx okay so then in that scenario you may bring all these rules to a new major version so something like 0 02 0 01 0 01 so the rules between these all these rule set versions will be moved together into a highest major version okay so incremental major version so that will have only those rules okay so as and when you are up whenever you are doing the skimming so you need to know which 
skimming you are doing? Is it a minor version skimming or is it a major version skimming? Okay, so major version skimming will automatically bring the major version incremented. Minor version will bring only the minor version updated. Okay, so here we do have the options available to do the skimming. So you just go to this configure system refactor rule sets. Okay, so this system refactor rule sets landing page will give you the option to do the skimming. So you see there's an option called skimmer rule set. So click on this. So here you may see there is an option called major version rule set scheme and minor version rule set scheme. So which rule set you want to skim it? So you just need to select it. So if it is a major version, you just see what all the major versions involved. So as of now, this is only having one version, the not a best practice because already one version is available. So you may go for minor version if in case required. So here also it is only having one version. If you have multiple, then only you can specify, but still we can go with 01. So you can just specify the scheme, okay? So once you click on scheme, it just bring all the rules which are available in 01 to 01, iPhone 02, iPhone 01, okay? So this is how you are going to do the skimming. So you need to know which, uh, which version of, uh, which version I need to use it. So in general, this is a task done by leads, okay? But you need to know about what is the procedure. So in general, as of now, even the, Senior developers has given this task of doing the skimming. So it depends, like you can give in any task. So you can see here there is 81 records skimmed. Now you can close it and you can open the rule set and see. Open the rule set. Okay, so you can see here the all the rules which are available in 01 is moved to 02. Okay, so if there are any uh, copied versions, it will just give the latest one. So if you have 010 patch version and there is the same rule which is available here as well as in the 10 version, so it will consider only the 10 version, not the one which is available in 01. So the latest one will be coming inside this. Okay, so remember that part. So this is how the skimming and once you do the skimming, you definitely need to update your application. So here there is a new rule set version that is coming in picture and we always need to take the highest version. So in order to take the highest version, definitely the application should be updated. So application version should be updated here. Okay, so in this application, the 01 iPhone 02 should be updated and you need to do a save operation. Okay, so this is how we are going to do.